detailed, realistic portraits, masterfully varied and duplicated. That's the work of the Kranos, father and son painters, who were among the most successful of the German Renaissance. The exhibition of their work in Moscow is a sensation. Nine Kranach paintings on loan from Germany are being shown alongside other works from the father and son for the first time since 1945. Those paintings had been secretly kept in storage in Russia since the end of World War II. It's simply an uplifting feeling to see this painting for the first time since 1945, St. Genevieve, or when I see this here, the wonderful mayor of Leipzig that we have here. This too is an absolute highlight, Adam and Eve. In May of 1945, the war in Europe was over and the Red Army was celebrating victory over the Nazis and plundering German museums. Among the artworks they looted were 17 paintings from the world-famous Kranach collection in Gotha. The paintings disappeared for 70 years in Russia. The reasons for that are well known. That was the peculiar policy of the Soviet leadership to keep everything under lock and key. Even art historians have only ever seen some of the paintings as reproductions in old catalogues. For instance, this work, The Burning of Hus, Books in Front of a Prince, which was considered lost for decades. Our most important task today is to make all of the artworks, regardless of how they ended up here in this museum, accessible to everyone, whether ordinary visitors or art experts. But they'll only be shown in Russia. There are no plans to return the looted artworks to Germany for the time being.